the magical feeling of match day and the desire to lose yourself in the moment. That's what today is all about. A meeting of two talented sides ready to go at it in front of a capacity crowd, not to mention the eyes of the wider football world. Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you from Manchester here on EA TV Live. And here we are at one of the great venues for football anywhere in the world, Old Trafford in Manchester. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It's Manchester United facing FC Copenhagen. Thanks, Derek. Well, the hosts are clear favourites going into this tie. But with that comes pressure, particularly against a team that will remain compact, are well-drilled defensively and are a threat on the counter-attack. If the hosts don't go through, though, it will be a major upset. This is the team Manchester United will go with. Casemiro plays alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Yeah, the same formation and the same sort of game plan. So this will all be about which individuals can get the better of their opponent. This will be a tough battle. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Can he finish? Chance, maybe. Now, just the tackle that was needed. Well, you sense it's just a matter of time before they do score, Derek. They've been piling on the pressure now and really should be ahead in this one. Yes, they just have to make sure they stay defensively compact here. Well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, Derek, what form is in at present? Second in the league table in terms of goals. He's been so clinical, and I expect him to score more goals today. Well, we can give them high marks for their passing, but can they make this pressure count? Could cross it in here. As though there might be a threat, but not so in the end. Good defending. Marcus Rashford. Diogo Dallo. Well, back and forth in terms of possession. Rashford. He's in control of the situation. Committed challenge. Ericsson. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Lisandro Martinez. Real determination in the challenge. A throw in here. Not much time to make up his mind. Christian Eriksen now. Diogo Dallo on the ball. Rashford. Could be threatening. Well, it did look promising, but no threat in the end. To give them the advantage. That was going in. So no more time left. That concludes the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams.
And I think it's fair to say that Bruno Fernandes has been taken out of this game. Well, I've been disappointed with him so far. He just hasn't worked hard enough to receive the ball. And as a result, he's hardly had a shot on target. The second 45 minutes then here at Old Trafford. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Good tackle. He's protecting it effectively. Bruno Fernandes has it. Couldn't keep it. Falk. Diogo Gonzalves. Making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. With a textbook interception. Dicing with a bit of danger here. Into reception. Please, can you go to reception if you've lost your keys? And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Marcus Rashford. Christian Eriksen now. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. Every pass hitting its target. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. Lisandro Martinez. Lindelof now. Bruno Fernandes has it. That's really good and effective physical play. Anthony. Real chance. And still trying to get the shot off. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Klaasson. Falk. That's useful play. There's the cutback. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, the United fans are certainly playing their part here. Just listen to this noise. But can they get a winner now? Manchester United venture forward. Do they have a winning goal in the future? Nicely timed tackle. And so into the final five minutes. Denis Vavro. So deflection, and it will be a throw-in. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Diogo Dallo. Well, there's a textbook example of how to press the ball. Good challenge and a throw-in coming up. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Diogo Gonzalves. Now Casemiro. There we have it. The 90 minutes are over and no...
are back underway here and it's quite simple both teams must steal themselves for 30 extra minutes and the player goes he was under a bit of pressure Anthony Fernandes must take the lead here and they have you've got to say it has been coming Well, it's not always the case, but these players have a real bond with Eric Ten Hag. You can just see it here. Well, it's lovely technique, as you can see. He just wraps his foot around the ball and bends it beyond the keeper. That's a good goal. Underway again here, one nil the score. Kevin Dix. Rasmus Falk Jensen on the ball. Chance to do damage. He could pick out a teammate. That was a menacing attack, but tidied up. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Falk. Victor Klasson. Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. And just like that, they don't have the ball anymore. There was the chance they could get caught out on the break here. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. The first period of extra time is over. 15 minutes left, maybe after that penalties, we'll see. Well, the second period of extra time commences. What drama do we have in store for us? Well, he's been forced out of play this time. Jordan Larson. And he's keen on cutting in. But really sticking to the task defensively. The cross is on. could level it and he clears the danger they know what they need and that's an equaliser here can he finish late drama here level once more incredible scenes Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. So back underway following the equaliser. Lisandro Martinez. And Rashford. Ball retention so important. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Fernandes. Credit to them for winning back possession. It always had the potential to go the distance, and it has, so a penalty shootout is next. And so the penalty shootout about to commence. And as a player, this foiled by the post. 
He had to score, and he does. And he steps up to take his penalty. And there it is, perfectly executed. And it's gone in. Mental preparation is such a big part of this. And the penalty converted here. Well, he's gone for finesse, and it's really paid off. And he's beaten the keeper. His turn to try to convert from the spot. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. And he succeeds in finding the bottom corner. So much on the line with regard to this penalty. And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. And he steps up to take the shot. And confidently converted. And there is the big moment in this penalty shootout. The goalkeeper's contribution means they have won it. Well, that's a top-class save. No wonder he's celebrating. That's a brilliant moment for him.